Um, so before we can create our application, uh, you have to, I mean, you have to, the client with server have to have some connection, right? Um, the connection is, is called uh, TCP or UDP. Uh, the TCP is kind of stable. You want your data very strict. You want you won't you want you don't you don't accept any mistake of this data. You have to use TCP, and uh, the UDP it can tolerate the error, um, which means a TCP will do some check. You send something will check if the data is correct, and the UDP just sent sent everything then without check. For example, TCP you you can used by many ways like uh, uh, SMTP, uh, many other um, common application. Um, but UDP normally we want to use like uh, real time uh, video transmission. Uh, because, for example, um, you you open you you use FaceTime to communicate with your family. It doesn't matter how how good the the video is, the quality of the video is. Actually, even the resolution is very low, but you still can understand the the person. Uh, this is something uh, used by UDP. Uh, if you want to know, um, but I highly recommend you guys to know something called a three times handshake. This is something to make sure server and client really, really talk each other. And uh, if we want to study CCP and UDP, we have to know something called Unix Network Programming. Uh, uh, here is a book about, I highly, re highly recommend you guys to start learning this book. It's called Unix Network Programming, uh, read by uh, Richard Stevens. It looks like this, something looks like this, yeah. And, uh, We have to to make a connection between client and the server. Uh, we have to create something called a socket. Socket is um, it's kind of this diagram, uh, pretty like um, telephone. When we call, what do we want to know? Uh, for example, try to call someone. The callee just like TCP server, okay? You, the caller, I mean you, just like a client. Okay, the server should, we, we should know, for example, at least we have to know the number, right? Your, the callee, the, the number of your callee. Uh, this process is, is called binding. Binding means your colleague should bind their number to their phone. Then the colleague must be, uh, I mean, the the handle of this telephone should be put in the proper way. If this, if doesn't put proper way, I mean, it's hung up, it won't accept the 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 phone or the power is not charged it won't listen your anything right any any call and after that it will be ready to accept your your call and uh, when you call it will accept your call i mean will hold the handle start to listening. Listening means 
it want to it will read your read something right then you can talk each other it will it will repeat this process listening talking listening talking right or talking listening you as a caller you start 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 dialing right you must know what you want to call I mean the number then you guys will create connection like a tunnel um, you guys start to talking each other talking each other this person this area talking each other then anyone of you guys start to say goodbye it will close any side right basically this is uh, uh, I mean it's not very it's not a very proper way to explain the client and the server but um, if we want to give a example I mean call each other it will be a very good example